Amid the ongoing conflict between Hamas and Israel in Gaza, protesters in support of Palestine came to the state capitol today demanding that the state treasurer divest Pennsylvania from Israel. And they made that message loud and clear inside the capitol. Here's a message to you today. Get the money back. It started outside. But for many, it ended with zip tie handcuffs after police declared the demonstration on the rotunda steps to be an unlawful assembly. The protest called for Pennsylvania to divest itself of some $56 million in Israeli bonds. We have a humanitarian crisis that is happening in Palestine right now. And instead of looking into a diplomatic way of handling it, Stacey Garrity is investing in Israel and forgetting about the Pennsylvania citizens. In a statement, State Treasurer Stacey Garrity defended the investments into Israeli bonds, including $20 million invested last year following Hamas's deadly attack in Israel that sparked the ongoing conflict. Capitol Police say 126 people were cited and detained in connection to the events. In Harrisburg, Tom Lehman, WGAL News 8. The Jewish leader in the Harrisburg area for reaction to the protest and the issue of investing in Israeli bonds. He said all loss of life in the conflict is sad, but also believes one side in particular is to blame. The, the images from Gaza are painful and brutal, and the moral responsibility of those deaths lie directly at the hands of Hamas. A number of Jewish leaders in Pennsylvania have also defended the Israeli bonds, saying they helped Israel defend itself against an enemy, an enemy trying to destroy it.